Hi guys, here on Variant24.com and today we will disassemble the smartphone Xiaomi Poco X3 GT. At the very beginning we need to remove the card tray. For this we take a special tool, insert it into the hole and push out the combined card tray. After that we need to heat the surface of the back cover to a temperature of about 70 Celsius degree or 160 degree Fahrenheit. For this we use a heating mat, you can use a hair dryer. And after 5 or 7 minutes we can move on to the assembly. To detach the back cover we will use a plastic film. It is a protective film from a new display or a film from the stationery store. Inserted into the gap between the middle cover and the back cover and run it along the length of the back cover. Since we have a cover that protects the cameras is separate, the back cover is additionally glued in the area of the camera cover. If the adhesive prevents us from opening the cover, we just cut it off with a scissors and we open the back cover, we have nothing on the cover. After that we need to unscrew the 9 screws at the top. We use a 1.5 mm Phillips screwdriver or hash hole. The screws look like they are all the same, but we still recommend placing them on a special surface in an easy to remember order for assembly. And we move on to unscrewing the screws at the bottom. The screwdriver is the same and the screws don't seem to be any different than before. After that we need to detach the middle cover. To do this we use a thin plastic film inserted into the gap in the area of the car tray and run it alone to detach the clips. Then we can use a bigger tool. We need to be careful on the corners because there the cover holds especially tight and we need to be careful on the side of the side buttons and fingerprint sensor because there they are physically located. On the middle cover we have the contact transmission lines and contact pads and the fingerprint sensor, of course. We carefully open the cover and lift it up. Now we need to disconnect the battery connector with a non-metal tool. Then also disconnect the fingerprint sensor connector and remove the middle cover. Then we disconnect the second battery connector. Ok, move on to disconnect the two coaxial cables on the subboard and disconnect the interboard cable connector. And we need to detach the speaker. We find the right place where we can lift it. Be careful there is a small antenna board attached to the speaker and coaxial cable is connected to the board. Leave the speaker and turn it over. We need to disconnect the connector. And we can take out the subboard. Carefully hook the edge and pull it out. As we can see on the subboard we have a microphone and charging port on the back side of the elements and in the frame of the display there is a vibration motor. Ok, we move to the motherboard. There we disconnect the connectors of the coaxial cables. We carefully disconnect all three connectors. Then we disconnect the connectors to the interboard cable and to the display. 
and we can detach the cameras. First, we remove the front camera and then the three rear cameras. It is better to hold the cameras so that they don't fly out and it is better not to touch the lenses so as not to damage them. If the camera is taped, it should be carefully lifted by the bottom and removed. After that we remove the motherboard. We find the right place where we can hook the board, lift it up and pull it out. So all we have to do is detach the battery. We rub the brown tabs with the letters A and B and read the description on label A. So, as it became clear to us from the description, we have to unwrap the above tabs, but carefully pull only the white tab A upwards. And we gently pull upwards and detach the battery. As we can see, under the battery there is a transparent coating that protects the cables. Ok, this is the end of our assembly. Thank you for watching and see you around or in the next video. Ok guys, now we're done. Thank you for watching. If you like what we do, please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel or read our articles on our website. Take care of yourself and until next video.